Now, this is old school rogue traders. Old school. Exactly. These two tarmac have started well. Look at them getting stuck into the bushes. It's great. Go on, pull it. Pull it like you're playing a punter. This is not much good. They've just pulled out the roots. They're not digging them out, and they've actually cut them off. They're not putting any weed killer down, so these roots are going to grow back very quickly and destroy the tarmac surface. But actually, they were a hive of industry until they swapped some weed killer for some killer weed. And then they're just gone, man. You smell that? I don't know, I smelt something. It was a bit it was strange, like it something great. wafting over from the side. I would my life was a woman. This is a crucial 20 minutes for the boys. Before it, they were in a rush. Now they're on a rush. That rush is straight. <laughs> head rush again. Thrilled with their new expanded consciousness, they experiment with crazy new tarmac techniques, which, to be quite frank, John doesn't appreciate. Oh, this isn't much good. They're bringing the hardcore in already. They haven't removed all the earth. There should be tons of earth taken out and replaced by the hardcore, because that hardcore should provide a really solid foundation for the asphalt that goes down. This is no good. Chill out, John. Don't have a cow. I can't believe that. They're actually using the sand they took off the driveway earlier on. It's mixed up with earth, stones and all sorts of rubbish to make up a mortar. John, man, you're so square. Can't you see two guys trying to make asphalt groovy? No, the for sale sign. Good grief, using that to try and level those down. That's unbelievable. Well, while John takes a chill pill, the tarmac arrives and the boys are suddenly looking forward to an early finish. I should get this finished for today, Lord. Today? Yeah. Excellent. How long till it's OK to park on it? Maybe just have it overnight. Oh, the tarmac's arrived. It looks as though they're spreading it far too thinly. A good quality material wouldn't be so spreadable as that. And look at the smoke coming off it, or steam or something. It looks as though it's got kerosene oil in it. And that helps them lay it. Certainly unsuitable for this job. John. Our driveway seems to have the consistency of a recently baked flapjack. Certainly does. Why is that? Well, shall we find out why? Dan? Right, what we've got here is, um, we've got just over an inch of asphalt. Um, we've got a very, very soft underlayer there and it's a very soft material that's totally unsuitable for the application. Okay, you say unsuitable. 